How's it going everybody? Ad Ricker here. It's not too often that the two drone worlds collide. The cinematic drones with GPS and hover and all that. And the FPV quads for racing and freestyle tricks. Today, we're on a rescue mission because there is a drone on top of that building and we're gonna try and get it down. Welcome to a new segment on my YouTube channel called Ed's Drone Recovery Service. So here's the setup we have. Sorry for the wind noise. I know it's got some wind here, but we have the Phantom 4 Pro with a little cable all the way down. Then we have our little grappling hook at the bottom. That's just a clothes hanger that I've bet, bent into four different points. We're gonna add a couple counterweights so it doesn't swing so much. Again, there's wind, so this is gonna be kind of interesting, but we'll, we'll see what we can do. So I think I'm gonna add a couple, just like a tape here, and maybe a tape higher up. Yeah, I'll so hold, you do what you need uh, to do. Doesn't spin so much or, you know, swing so much. Okay, so you think it's facing this way? It's, it's toward the corner of the building? That's what it looked like. We've done this before, trying to lift a drone with another drone, but the problem was we were using a device that was mounted on the back as opposed to dead center. So the, the, the back props were spinning way too much and the front props weren't working so hard. So it wasn't, and I think that's why that test failed. Yeah, um, yeah, that yeah. test was with Chris Rollins back in Texas last year. So we're gonna use the Mavic Air to scope out where exactly this thing is. Then we're gonna launch the Phantom 4 Pro uh, with the hook once we have the Mavic Air in place. Then maybe we won't hit any poles up there. Cause I know there are a couple antenna that are up yeah. on the building too. <laughs> Way out in the middle, it's open at least. <laughs> at least there's nothing around it. Okay. That's good. <laughs> Go ahead and hold that. And I'm gonna see if we can get up. A phantom. Okay, throttling up and let it go. My depth perception is a little off because I can't see how if I'm near it or not. Can you see? Yeah, you can tell. So keep coming down a little bit. Down, down, down. You're about, you're, looks like you're about three feet off the ground up there. Do you have sidewalls on your frame? No. Ah, uh, yes. Yes, I, I do. It's a, no, a Skito Nova. Yeah. That helps. Okay, so the Coke is on the ground. Yep. So now, woo, getting pushed, getting pushed. Must be really windy up there. Well, I'm swinging. I'm swinging a lot. I got you. Let me, let me just touch down a little bit. Things like there. There it if is. If I can just lock it down like an anchor. Yeah, exactly. Just drag it if nothing else, right? I'm getting little GPS issues too. Oh, that's not cool. Compass error, it says. It's a little bit less windy right now. Yeah, yeah. I can see it from here. You still have low compass? Or yeah, low GPS, low, low GPS, low compass. Oh, oh. <laughs> I, I lifted up one end of it. Bend um, one side up further, so if we have to, we can have more of a hook. There yeah, you go. I'll bend the sharp ones up mm. higher. And it felt like it had a little bit of You ready? One, two, three.
Oh, you got it, dude. Ha <laughs> ha There it goes. Ow! Oh. <laughs> All right. Mostly a success. We got it off the roof, right? <laughs> now, I kind of wish that we hadn't just dropped it on the cement, but we're going to see how well it held up here in a second. No way. No way, dude. It's okay? It's fine. That's crazy. Like, the, the camera lens is a little dented. Mm. Dude, other than that, I think hey. it's good. Let's... Looks like all the motors still spin. Dude. You got a little Black ding right one. there. Yeah. It didn't crack the lens though. Hey, lens so that's okay. good. Cool. I guess that means we gotta get back on the horse. Let's do some flying. Oh. 